Hello, ladies and gentlemen, Blank Check here. And we are back to kick off this MLP hiatus in style with a familiar face. But before that, an update on why I missed a week there. I'm currently recording around 300 miles away from my usual location, which is now my former location because I primarily spent the week moving. I am now officially out of the college town where I spent the past six years, as well as living outside Virginia for the first time in my life. So yeah, it's been a busy week. Most things are unpacked, there's still a few loose ends to deal with, and I'll be starting my first real job in a few weeks. As for what happens after that, well, time will tell. But for now, for Galorga. He's back, like clockwork, three months after his last video, Secrets of the Main Six, we have Give Me Your Wings, his 11th video to date. And I wonder how much power is behind that imperative. This is not Starlight Wants Your Wings, this is Give Me Your Wings. It's kind of intimidating given the context of what Starlight is in Forge's universe. At this point I'm wondering if the video is Starlight systematically stealing all the princess's wings one at a time, or if it's her stalking Twilight for five minutes. Then again, technically she could be stealing wings from Pegasi, so maybe Fluttershy and Rainbow Dash will pop up. Either way, it's for Galorga, so we know it's gonna be... something special. So let's get to it. Alright. Fort Book. The Fort of the Flies. Talk about eye candy. And the map calls. But it's actually Starlight in disguise polymorphed into a map. Was that alcohol? What was that? <laughs> Don't mind me, I'm just magic horse. Floating quills. Deciding which quill. Oh. Alright, I'll take a feather from every eligible mare in Ponyville to create my own wings. And it'll have the power and essence of every single Pegasus. Therefore, it's the best wings. I'm getting flashbacks to, uh, cupcakes right now. Don't make a suit out of wings, Starlight. <laughs> That's fun. Wow. That's a, uh, uncharacteristic... Forgalorga sound effect there. Ooh, nice! Alright, that's the first time I've seen an invisibility like that used in one of these uh, show-like Flashy Boy animations. What? <laughs> Alright, just take the uh, wrench here and the pliers. Uh, torque it a little bit. And boom! Wing! Oh no, Fluttershy! The most dainty and pleasant wings in Equestria. Alright, we got a nice uh, Doctor Who slash SCP reference in here. I appreciate that. <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> that, yep, that's Forgalorga. That's something you would never see in, uh, egg roll. <laughs> no spoilers! And if she takes her own wing... Oh, kinky. Her own fake starlight wing. Can she just rip those wings off? Like, it's perfectly fine. If, if... Chrysalis turns into a pony, and then someone rips an appendage off. Would she be able to reform that when she comes back to being a changeling, or how does that work? I'm sure it'll happen in the show. They'll answer my question. Finale. Hey, a switch! Smash Brothers! Coming out, didn't you hear? 64 characters! 65? Uh, Celestia, that's frowned upon in 47 states. <laughs> wow, that's creative, all right. 
I like that it's a, uh, a physical thing. It's not part of the fourth wall, it's just an actual slant of black. That's a weird looking spike. Oh. Wow, nice! Okay. Forward thinking for Galorga here. <laughs> Come on, how does he get wings before me? I know I've been here for fewer seasons, but I've definitely accomplished more things. I saved the world. <laughs> it's their persistence that really sells it. Doesn't work the first time, but you know what? Oh, back to our boring, ordinary lives. Man, I hate being a Pegasus. What happened? Where'd she go? What's on her tail? I have many questions. I'm glad that that's a medal on her neck and not a collar to go with those... of bracelets. Yes! By our powers combined! I can fly! Ooh, and they're all colorful. Nice little fringed edges. Well, that was a short-lived glory. Just rip her wings off. Just straight off. If I can't have wings, you can't. <laughs> you know? According to DeviantArt, that's probably all you need. Bat wings are cooler anyway. Don't mind me. What? Pony wings? Pfft. I never wanted those. I've always been a bat on the inside. It's my bat Sona. Quote, Starlight Glimmer, 2018. Real quote. I promise. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that was Give Me Your Wings from Forgalorga. And that was very much a Forgalorga video. It was smooth. It was creative. It was a bit risque. Yep, that fits his M.O. This was actually his longest video to date, but it was still paced well because the jokes worked and there was variety in what Starlight did. And it's great that he worked in such a contemporary reference with Spike's transformation, though he of course did not put this together in just the last month. Those episodes did leak out a while ago, so he had some time. This one did feel a little toned down in terms of Forga's Starlight videos, maybe because of the more methodical pace. But it's still not as inoffensive and laid-back as what you'd see on Agrol Channel. Starlight had some questionable methodology, turning invisible to do who knows what with that purple mare, grabbing a feather from apparently a pretty sensitive spot from Fluttershy, tying up Chrysalis disguised as herself, and then Celestia with her pet royal guard. Okay, I take it back, this was definitely weird for Galorga. We got plenty of Forgalorga at his most Forga-ist. And then whatever mission Twilight was on, I kind of hope Forga's next video is Twilight's mission that was alluded to here. I want answers as to what happened there. They might scar me, but I want answers. Anyway, this was a very nice Forgalorga video. He is not missing a beat. And I hope he keeps it up for time to come. As for you all, thank you for watching! And until next time... Remember, you can't force change. You have to work toward it. Or be Spike. <laughs>